Hey guys, welcome back to the life of Kelly. Come closer. Come closer. Baby, come dance with me. Give me that and give me that. Bring that body to me. You are my remedy. Baby, go come closer. Come closer. I like it when you bend over. Come closer. My body like a Range Rover. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh, the sun is that side. Oh, I my at this point because I feel like it would have been more practical for me to do the intro when I'm coming from the gym because the sun comes from the opposite direction and now I'm going like in that direction. So I'm just gonna quickly do this intro. So in this video today, it's like a come to the gym with me, uh, see my gym MFS, see the founder of MFS and see what like a, a, a day at the gym looks like for me and then at the end of the video i'm also going to do my q a i'm also going to do my q a uh, that you guys asked me on instagram about this journey of mine of where i lost weight and how i did it what did i do what not to do and all of that so i'm already here as you can oh you can see him you can see him i'm already here so yeah let's go in guys So these are the trenches of cardio. So today the first exercise was the battle rope as a warm up and cardio. Uh, most of the times I'm in the trenches, you know. So today I was really happy about the battle rope. And then yeah, there I was, you know, uh, just kind of doing what i was supposed to do warming up burning some calories and stuff and then after that we moved on to the second exercise so most of the times nene shows me the exercises but sometimes like i know the exercises so he just like tells me what to do and doesn't really have to do much demonstrating blah, blah. so yeah there I was monkey see monkey do obviously If you like to ask questions, down tempela was happening. So one of the questions I received was what was your favorite exercise? So my favorite exercise is just squat, anything squat. Come when I jump squat, weighted squat, uh pal squat like anything squat is my favorite exercise which then essentially makes leg day my favorite day so here's another fun fact i really also enjoy lunges obviously they are part of leg day so i i really do generally enjoy lunges especially reverse lunges and then after this exercise particularly is my newly found lover like uh, recently got this machine so like nene made me do this exercise this other day and i just loved it so much i don't know there's just something in this exercise that just makes me so happy and here it is guys obviously rethinking my life choices at this point
usually after this i don't even want to talk to him i just really want to go home but today i had to stick around for this q a stuff damn that damn good damn good damn good damn good okay guys so it is currently after my session i'm very tired but we're gonna do this q a stuff so i wanted to just sit down and do the questions myself but he'll be joining me he'll be asking me the questions and then i'll be answering <laughs> hi um hope you're excited as i am well my name is kunene founder and owner of the gang gang mfs which just basically stands for mitimi fitness and sports mfs was from when 20, 22 yeah 2022 main reason behind it was just you know a young guy just unemployed straight out of varsity in a way you know and like a two two three years break after graduation without being employed and you know just finding work here and there until this idea just came why not start something out of your hobby in a way and i was like yeah let's give it a shot but it surprised me as to how far it came it wasn't basically my intention to take it this far because it was just a backyard gym that i wanted to hop into whenever i feel bored or lonely just to take out the stress of being unemployed until people like your youtuber came by you know the beauty of having youtubers in your journey you know they just get to spread the word and get your product out there and now we're on to greater things and greater heights and all thanks to the one above, hey? Glory be to God and you know. Para -pa -pa -pa! Oh, I'm loving it. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. Take one. Take one. So I've got a question here for you, right? Mm -hmm. One of your followers would like to know, when did you start exercising and what was the main reason for your journey? Um, I don't know, hey, because like in Tumbe Gaan, like maybe around 2021, 2020, but I was just never consistent. <laughs> You're distracting me. Very <laughs> cheap, the fun. The fun clip. I'm from this one, I'm like, gym, like, it's all about gym. So, so I mean, they get to be there just because it's all about gym. So when I started uh, my journey or exercising or whatever, it was I think it was in 2020 during lockdown, but I was never consistent. And when I went back to school in 2021, I went to the gym, but I was also just never consistent. So last year I was home full time, and then I started in January. I was like, you know what? This time around, I don't have a reason to procrastinate. I, I can't say I'm always studying. I don't have time. So I'm just gonna go ahead with it. So from January till September, I was doing it on my own until I joined MFS late in boom, October boom, boom. last year. <laughs> yeah, I joined MFS last year late in October until now. So yeah, the reason behind me exercising was just obviously to lose weight and tone down my body not necessarily that i have a problem with my weight just tone down my body you know look sexy and sheer you know crop top girl and and on the vibes so with that said one would also like to know were you on a specific diet and helping you i don't know whether you've reached your goals or not no i don't want to necessarily say i've reached my goals because i think i can still do a little bit more although like I've done most of the job. So then in terms of diet, I don't even want to lie. I did not follow any specific diet. Although I did try last year to go on a low red meat diet, like pescatarian vibes, you know, for like a what? month. Yes. No, is it like <laughs> what would you just choose? Pescatarian. Bombastic words. Yes. So um yeah, it was literally just that. And then I also went on no sugar weeks lots of them i still do that now and incorporated drinking green tea every morning and tea at night before i sleep intermittent fasting sometimes i eat from 11 to 8 
food and down that but there was no specific diet i still ate what they ate at home because it was really difficult to eat something different from what they were eating so yeah i still eat what they eat i'll just like maybe control portions and stuff like that would also like to know what kept you motivated what kept me motivated is i think the inner child in me kept me motivated most of the time because i was obviously bullied when i was younger so boom, boom, boom. bully bully what do you mean it was bully sorry, bully no, i don't support such just, just the child in me guys yes the child in him so yeah i think that what, what that's what kept me motivated also knowing that uh i've got my own goal to reach like i said uh, i knew where i wanted to be and i knew that i'm capable of doing such so i just wanted to stretch out my potential and see where i can get and that's what kept me motivated and the more i started doing this especially after i joined mfs i started like really enjoying it oh and so just it's like this is something that i can't stop doing now oh well, yeah. What's something you wish to? You wish you knew. So cool. What's something you wish you knew when you started your journey? Uh, something I wish I knew was that it's not always gonna be roses and candles and all of that. Because obviously, when you start something new, it's always like we work on But hey, so so as the time goes, and then you come here and. And then it makes you do cardio and stuff and you know that you hate cardio it's like do i really want to be here do i really want to do this and you just remember yeah you know so it's not always roses and sweets and candles and everything nice some days you wake up and you just feel like you don't want to go and also for me personally sometimes i'm too hard on myself that if i miss coming to the gym like then my entire day just goes some wrong one and I just feel like I'm, I, be, I become too hard on myself. Like, why didn't you go to the gym? And I, I deserve rest. I get that, but it's it's very difficult to to let go of that. Here's the top of the question: What advice would you give to someone that's just about to start exercising, or is just not sure about exercising? Uh, baby steps. Baby steps. I would say. Uh, don't go in there wanting to do six days a week Monday to Saturday start maybe with three days a week at least three days a week start light you can even start at home before committing to joining the gym because it might get overwhelming so you might you can start at home you know get a little skipping rope and maybe dumbbells and then do follow home exercises and stuff like that just to get yourself active and then warm into the idea of going to the gym and then also talking to someone sometimes like it's not the best person to ask man like, always live always yeah. prefer a morning or an afternoon session definitely. and why would you say so uh, definitely morning because i just feel like if i come to the gym in the morning my session is at six by the way six to seven even in winter uh i think if i just come to the gym it just starts up my day and it's like out of the way so i can just go about my day so if i have to come in the afternoon i just feel like uh, i'm not a morning person i'm a morning gym person this is a question from mfs guys we're done with that question tell us <laughs> see i'm gonna dump on my guide just to show you okay wait i'm gonna match your energy no this one is heavy i take this one oh. <clears throat> Since you've been with us, bum, bum, bum. what would you say as your highlight? I know you've got a lot of highlights, but throughout the journey, what would you say is your highlight moment or moments, if there is such word, that you've encountered with us? And most importantly, what would make you happy in such a way of helping us grow? Suggestion box, guys, basically. Oh, okay. Comment down below yeah. suggestions on how we can improve. Thank you for helping me out. Okay, so the highlights of being a part of this MFS family is that I get to see it grow every day, guys, and I get to see my ideas being incorporated. So it's like, no, he actually listens to me, you know, so I've got valuable suggestions and stuff. So yeah um but also coming here 
learn as much as uh, my trainer or gym instructor or whatever he's also my friend you know so when i come here and i because most of the time because it's six i'm alone i get to gym and vent at the same time you know so that's basically the highlight is that my mental health and my physical health are being taken care of all, all in one you know i pay and then it's like three in one therapy uh, personal training mm -hmm. and gym all so that's the highlight and also just coming here man it's, it's a it's a great space he's not a bad person he's, a, he's not bad most of the time subscribe <laughs> Subscribe, subscribe. Don't forget. Follow us, subscribe, follow us. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. And, and let's come gym. Come gym, guys. If you're around, Bongo, Linyenge, Zanin, Kujwana, Jitipele, Muladi, Mwamita. Guys, this is the place to be. Like, it's coming. I'm also going to drop a link in my description box. It's a survey. MFS survey, please go fill that out, guys. We're trying to do something big out here. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, Shit. and turn on your post notifications so you get notified follow. every single time I post. Don't forget to follow me on my social media platforms, uh, Nene at Sportsman. Uh, is it sportsman underscore? Yeah, yeah, sportsman underscore. Nene or sportsman. I'll link his Instagram in my bio in the description box and also follow MFS and Timby Fitness and Sport. And stay tuned, yeah, guys. Thank you. Bye.